Yeah, yeah. 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 Well, brilliant to have you here. We were just watching some of Saturday Night Show. That was an amazing moment, wasn't it? Talk us through being in the room and singing while that was going on. I think on, on that particular song, I almost lost my part because uh, I was I, I, I was busy watching the dance. I looked up and next thing I seen hands are throw it in the air and I thought, where are they? And throw her again. <laughs> yeah, throw it again, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, you have to try, try and keep really focused. Do you ever get lost in a moment like that? Um, every now and again you do, if you, if, if you look up and watch the dance, uh, um, but try and stay focused for it, and Dave Arch makes sure we're, we're all in our place. <laughs> yeah, we used to sing Dave Arch, and uh, he gets his camera shot at the moment. Yeah. We don't necessarily get to know you guys that well as part of the programme, so that's why it's lovely to, to meet you here and, and hear stories and, and your involvement, because you've been there since the start, have you? Since, since the very yeah, first one? since the pilot. I've been lucky enough to sit in that seat since the pilot, yeah. Wow. And Bruce used to say, you've got the best seat in the house, you know. How much has changed since then? Because I know when we look back at the pictures of the first series, it does it looks really different doesn't it? How much of it has changed for you? Um, it's gone from being this uh, uh, not smaller type show to, to, to this massive e extravaganza. The budgets have got bigger. Um, it's, it, 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 it's a joy to work on. It really is a joy to work on. Well, you can see that from your smile in these photos. <laughs> Absolutely great. And the music, you, you're doing it all live because I guess that when yeah. it's such a complicated live programme, there must be a temptation to to pre-record it, but I guess it's that it's it, it's all about the music. It has to be live. You have to have to respond. And I think that's what uh, a, a massive magic part of the show is the music. You know, having live music on a on a Saturday. There's not many shows do live music these days, and uh, so to be able to sing with a, you know a, a large orchestra uh, every Saturday night in front of that many people, you know. In Spanish. In Spanish sometimes. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's really impressive. Scouser singing Spanish. Yeah. <laughs> Won't be the first time. Because um, it's not just Strictly that you're working on at the moment. You're actually going out on your own tour, aren't you? Tell us about that. Yeah, I'm going to be working with the National Youth Jazz Orchestra, um, uh, a guy called Mark Armstrong who leads them. And, and these are incredible musicians. Uh, a lot of the musicians that play in the Strictly Band have gone through Nigel. Dave Arch was part of Nigel. Trevor Barry, who plays the bass guy in the hat, you see, is, he was part of Nigel. Most of the horn section have gone through Nigel as well. So we're doing the music of Ray Charles. And um, uh, from, uh, when did we start? I think um, March till April next yeah. year, all around the country. Really excited just to be working with these incredible young musicians because they're the future, you know. And what great songs as well, Ray Charles. Oh. What, what do you love about him? Everything. <laughs> Everything about him. He's, he's a, I, I love his humour, of course the music. And what I like mostly about Ray Charles is the different genres he covered and the success he had with all the different genres, you know, country and western album where they said, oh, we can't do a country and western album, R&B acts can't do that. And it was the most successful country and western album. You know. And you will be centre stage, which is slightly different to your Saturday nights because we don't yeah. normally get to see you are a little bit hidden. Which do you prefer? Um, I like both. Yeah, I, I like the, uh, the intimacy sometimes of doing small things and uh, yeah, I, as long as I'm up there doing it and playing, I don't really, I'm not really bothered. You just love music, don't I you? I love music. Yeah. That's all I've ever done all my life, you know, yeah, yeah. Is it all you ever wanted to do? Yeah. Yeah. It's all I can remember. It's all I can do, you know. Um, and I, I, I play and stuff. And yeah, I'm always happiest when I'm around musicians and I feel very comfortable when I'm around musicians. But what are you happiest singing and listening to yourself? What are you into? Obviously, Ray Charles, but you've yeah. got quite a, a, a wide ranging. There, there is a wide range, but I think my love is is, um, is jazz and, and um, uh, Donny Hathaway, Marvin Gaye type stuff, Luther Van Dross type things, and uh, old school, a bit old school. But and Gangnam Style. I go, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That one. <laughs> when, when you heard that, you know, okay, here's your plan for the week, and it includes um, Ed Balls dancing to Gangnam Style. Yeah. What was it? And you're going to have to sing it, what? Well, uh, um, yeah, you look at the paper and it's all in Korean and stuff, but it's phonetically <laughs> broken down. And you're just praying that you're not going to offend anybody who's Korean, because you, you don't, I don't know what I've said half the time. Or, you know. And do you ever look at the list and think, I just really don't want to sing that? Or is there any, there's one that, that's got you and you thought, I'd, ah, it's just not my cup of tea? I can't think of a, of a particular one, but there's, there is every now and again that you think that really doesn't suit me, but you work it and work it and, and it eventually sort of... You, you sort of get it, you know. And I guess you're working it because it's about the dance, isn't it? It's about the dancers. So yeah. you're working really closely with them. Do you get to chat with them about what they want? Or do... um, that's normally less production and, and, and stuff. And, and Dave, 
we, we, what we do is try and stick exactly to to the script um, so we can't really go off and do an ad-lib here or yeah. sing that <laughs> yeah, in case they've could it ruin the dance yeah exactly yeah, yeah. so we, we try and stay exactly to, to what we've been given as, as the edit you know who's your favorite this year <laughs> oh, I can't because I've got to okay. go back next week <laughs> <laughs> oh it's so great to see you Tommy thank you so much oh, thanks, thank thanks. you oh, nice. lovely to meet you yeah and the music of Ray Charles, performed by Tommy Blaze, and the National Youth Jazz Orchestra goes on tour, as Tommy said, next year. Tommy Blaze, what a fantastic name. Perfect, yes. You're watching Breakfast, is it?